Hi everyone. Today we're going to talk about the second tutorial, which is introduction of the tiny ML kit that you guys are going to use for this course. We're going to have uh, to the document once, and then we're going to go into further introductions and see the hardware kit in person. So you can go ahead and open the tiny ML tutorial two for module three from the calendar you will be introduced to this document. It has some description of the kit that we're gonna to provide to you and the four major components, that is the Arduino Nano 33 VLE, the USB micro B cable to connect the Arduino to your system, a breadboard, um, a camera sensor with the breakout PCB, which is the OV7675 module. We're gonna set up the kit in the video and continue from there. Here we have the tiny ML kit in person. We have the uh, the box which has all these four components. So this is the Arduino Nano BLE 33 sense. It has a variety of different sensors and you can just pull it out from the um, thermocol that it's already on. So it's quite a small form factor of a, PA, of a device. And this device is what you're gonna use to run all your machine learning applications on. Now, this is the tiny ML shield, which is a very efficiently designed breakout PCB board so that you can uh, interface your camera without too many disturbing wiring connections and easily power your Arduino separately from your computer as well. This is the micro USB cable, which you're gonna connect to your um, Arduino. So this is the Arduino Nano uh, BLE. We're gonna take the, the the cable and just insert it right here, and connect the other end uh, to the USB port of your laptop. This is the camera module, which is the OV7675. We're gonna quickly open up, open that. We have the OV7675 module. Be careful not to uh, put your hands on the top of the camera lens because it gets smudged, and then. It's very difficult to you know make what the images are. So yeah, you're gonna use this camera module onto the on the shield, and then we're gonna connect it to the Arduino. So take your shield on your shield on your left hand and the module on your right, and put the and align the header pins, which are these, as you can see in the video, and align them right on top of this shield. So we're gonna do something like this. It's quite, you have to put some effort to put it in, but yeah. Uh, next, we're gonna take the Arduino BLE. So you see there's this USB mark here. You're gonna al align the USB port of your Arduino right on top of it and slowly slide it in to the header pins into the breakout board. So there you have it. We have the uh, setup completed. Now your Arduino can be easily powered using the USB cable, right? And uh, align it to the USB port on the Arduino Nano. And then you also have a power outlet, which you can connect using a normal nine volt battery. And then you can also have a functionality of some other breakout pins, such as some digital and analog pins to connect. And then there's a button, which you can also interface and connect your Arduino and get two variety of applications with it. So yeah, this is tutorial two. Thank you.